Time to look at the weather. Time to bring in Pat Pagano as we spend a few minutes together. Good morning, Pat. And uh, good morning. Uh, I don't know how good it is. I don't know, but yesterday, the There's bulk so of yesterday better. was one of the most beautiful days we've had in a long time. There wasn't for about a four and a half, five hour stretch. There wasn't a cloud in the sky. There wasn't a breeze. It was like 70 degrees. It was absolutely beautiful for about five hours. Right. What a bust with the computer models. Real big bust. And I have a feeling it's going to be a bust today, too. I'm looking at the very newest um, GFS American model. Completely new, folks. Uh, And um, they're saying for cloud cover. And it's broken down in three-hour periods. Overcast, 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 overcast. 20% chance of rain. High today, 59. Is it going to be right? Or is it going to be wrong? I think it's going to be wrong. It's so darn dry over us right now that I don't think there's going to be any precip at all. And I know I went with a chance of showers, but that's because of all this junky guidance that I am learning quickly uh, I am not going to depend on this winter because if I do, um, I'm going to be in trouble. I think I'm just going to have to, as we say, fly with the seat of my pants uh, and depend more on a model like the Euro. So I think today is going to wind up being partly cloudy. Could there be a chance of a shower? Yeah, no big deal. Don't blink your eyes. You'll miss it. Highs 60 to 65. Tonight, cloudy upper 40s now tomorrow cloudy but not because of the storm because of a front coming in from the west but i still don't think there'll be any rain low 60s sunday breaks of sun and clouds should be a nice day low 70s and monday there may be some early showers otherwise partly cloudy and a high of 70 so as you can see the weather forecast for the weekend has improved dramatically since uh, the last couple of days. And it was funny when I was riding home yesterday. It was just gorgeous. I said it's to right, myself, gorgeous. I just said, "Wow, what a day!" And then it got cloudy, but it but 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 it got but it didn't. You know, it, it just got cloudy. Which, when you live through and you see such a beautiful day where there's not a cloud in the sky, you know, and the sun, you know, and, and when the clouds came in, the temperature dropped about ten, ah, say about ten degrees. Uh, but it what it was just gorgeous. I couldn't believe it. That's the problem. Um, Again, the problem is that uh, you you were expecting the clouds to move in a lot quicker, and they just didn't. Yeah. Uh, and and the models got a problem with timing, a uh, real bit uh, problem with timing. Well, so uh, yeah, I don't want to depend on this model for the winter. I can tell you that right now. Well, this is all good because today, tomorrow, and uh, Sunday, uh, the Salisbury Fall Festival in Salisbury and Lakeville. Today and tomorrow in Pine Plains, it is the Pine Plains Fall Festival. Uh, on Saturday from 1 till 6 in Millerton, New York, it's Fall for Art. I mean, there's so many different things that are going on this weekend. And now it looks like uh, people can actually go out there and actually enjoy it. Not right. Wor- not That's worry the about way it looks. Yeah. Right. That is the way it looks. Yep. And the, you worried about that? Yeah, I, I think that's good. I think that's good. Yeah. But I no. was I was thinking your you, your ears should have been burning because I was thinking about you going home yesterday. They were they were burning and so it was you know <laughs> I was just burning up anyhow because um, because of you know I went back and looked at all the the data with the computer models and uh, I'm saying to myself boy this is just a pits they're just not right you know and I'm looking at the satellite picture and I'm saying well just shaking my head and you know I remember one TV guy the night before yesterday saying that Thursday was going to be the worst day. That was when everyone was going to get the most rain, the most wind. Boy, was that a bust. <laughs> a big-time bust. Yeah. A big-time bust. Well, the I Yankees the, the, Yanke- the Yankees are in the American League Championship Series now. Uh, they kick off mm-hmm. in Houston. We don't have to worry about forecasting them. They're in, I think they're in Houston uh, for two games uh, to, to begin with. Uh, the, the Saturday and Sunday games are in Houston. Oh, so. they're in Houston. I thought they were coming home. How come they didn't come home? Because Houston has the best record in baseball, so I think they get they play the first two games in Houston, the next right. three games in New York, and then if needed, uh, the final two games in Houston. Oh, so, so that's that. That's the way that looks. And what is our um, what is our uh, um, 
sports um, scientist think is going to win? Well, Houston uh, is is the best team in baseball. They really are. Uh, the Yankees are, are my team, and the Yankees are probably the second best team in baseball. Um, can the Yankees it, and Houston has home field advantages? Four of the games are in Houston, and three in in New York. If if, if it goes seven games, so the, Houston has home field advantage. Houston has a much better starting pitcher. The Yankees have much better bullpen. Uh, the hitting is about the same on both teams. So uh, I would I would think that's that Houston's going to win. Uh, I want the Yankees to win. Boy, do I want the Yankees to win. Right. But uh, if 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 Houston doesn't win, it'll be surprising. It'll be surprising. This is the Yankees' second American League Championship Series in three years, and this is Houston's third. This is their third year they're in it. Uh, uh, they won one and they lost one, so it's it's going to be uh, it's it's going to be fun to watch. That's all you can say, and hopefully the Yankees will win. But I, realistically, uh, the Astros with their pitching should 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 win. So, um, so now did the Yankees ever enter the World Series against Houston before? No, but uh, two years, three years ago, they were they played Houston in this in, in the American League Championship Series, and they lost. Uh, Four games to three, um, and uh, I'm afraid uh, the, the same fate awaits. But I hope not. So we'll see. That's kind of interesting. See, there you go. Know, that's, that's where we stand with that. So you'll be busy next week with the Yankees. Ah, <sighs> just lovely. Yeah. And when do you say they come home? Uh, they, uh, uh, I'm not sure what. Uh, I'm pretty sure because they play Sunday, they probably won't be playing until Tuesday. I would think at, at, at a starting at home. So we'll see. Okay. I could be wrong about that though. Uh, let me take a look. Hang on. Let me take a look at the full okay. schedule. Let me just take a look at the full schedule here. Okay. Uh, the Yankees will play at home Tuesday. Yeah, Tuesday. And Wednesday okay. and Thursday uh, next week. Because th- uh, well, Wednesday may be the problem uh, because of another system coming in with rain. But we shall see. All right. And you're all set to go up and close well, up shop. You know, am I set? Yeah. I mean, literally, uh, the mind is. <laughs> is the body ready? <laughs> it's a lot of work. It is really a lot of work. And then uh, you compound the fact that uh, all of this has to be done in addition to more uh, filming with the movie. And uh, you are looking at um, one very tired guy by the time he gets back here. So on Tuesday, hopefully I'll be very much relaxed and uh, and all of that may have me. Don't forget, we're still not doing the movie. We're doing the movie out the lake then we have to go to the city and we have to shoot there for a couple of weekends uh, told you about this movie nobody wanted to listen to me <laughs> right. it's over our head well pat i want you to have as good a weekend as you can That's have right. rest trying rest up on monday and be bright and bright-eyed bushy and bushy-tailed tail. on tuesday all right because because right. because the yankees and i need you all right okay. all right pat take care thanks marshall bye-bye Pat Pagano this morning in the Weather Center with a check on our tri-state forecast here on Robin Hood Radio.